Hi, welcome to Let's Play Bastion. Um, first thing I'm going to say is that this is my first LP, so uh, I don't know how this is going to go, but you can rate this, like it, whatever, comment, give me some improvements. I'm uh, currently just using my laptop mate just now because I don't really have any money for a proper setup, but soon I shall get a pretty decent setup, but for now I'm going to make do with this. Um, I decided to Let's Play Bastion because it was an indie game and I've really started getting into them a lot recently. So yeah, so let's go, I'll get on with this. I played this for about 15 minutes last night to get used to the controls and stuff, but um, apart from that, this game's totally new to me. Proper store is supposed to start at the beginning. Ain't so simple with this one. Now here's a kid whose whole world got all twisted, leaving him stranded on a rock in the sky. I'm Morgan Freeman. Wow, that guy really sounds like Morgan Freeman. He gets up, sets off for the bastion, where everyone agreed to go in case of trouble. Oh, there's the lovely hand-painted scenery falling from the sky. Ground That's, forms up under his feet as it points away. Really nice. He don't stop to wonder why. Finds his lifelong friend just lying in the road. Oh, his lifelong friend's a hammer. Must be really attached well, to that hammer. Touching reunion. Oh man, bending under indestructible scenery. Awesome. Wow. He sees what's left of the rippling walls. Years of work undone in an instant. In the calamity. I'm really enjoying the uh, the ambient music in the background. It's really nice. It's quite That's relaxing. Survivor. Oh man. dear, what's that? It's a gas fella. That's a Forced guy with a pickaxe. It's a Minecraft outcast. Kid pops him oh dear. Good. Fella oh, got a piece okay. of it low. Man, this, this scenery is really destructible. It's really fun to destroy as well. It just rages for a while. <laughs> and, and the narrator's commenting about how mentally he's going destroying the scenery. That's beautiful. Okay, I should stop getting distracted by destroying the scenery. What's that? Oh! What are those things? They kind of look like... I don't know. I don't know what they look like. They're probably currency in this game anyway. An old repeater falls out of the sky. Oh no, weapons are falling out of the sky too. Oh dear. I really don't want a sword to fall on my head. That's, that's not going to be cool. I should pick it up anyway. Got a holder still to spin up the chamber. Oh wow, I can fire stuff. Thanks, Morgan Freeman, for this lovely repeater. Okay. Kids worked up quite a thirst by now, so that fountain looks real inviting. Sometimes you just need a drink. Oh, that's kind of like Dark Souls. Yeah, you, when you rest that campfire, you get your uh, hit plus. A school of squirts tunnels up around them. Must have fled here from the mines. What the hell are these things? They kind of look like slugs. Yeah, I really hope this game isn't as hard as Dark Souls. Then we might we might be in for something if it is. Oh. Kid finds a memento from a girl he knew. Always use the fancier. Oh, that's sweet. That's not nice though. Game it's a impressive. wonder the old saloon's still standing. Used to have the nicest view. It's really good that we're getting some backstory already. It shows a good promise for character development. Which I like, I really enjoy character development. Oh, that's handy. Press F to heal. He sets <coughs> foot inside one of Selandia's famous watering holes. Inside's old Rondi, the bartender. The Calamity got him for his drinking dead. Does the Calamity turn people into stone? Um, I don't want to get turned into stone. Let's go see what this guy's then doing. he finds his trusty shield. Nah, I'm not sure what he's up to first. Oh man, he's he's just chilling. He's just he's just chilling up here. Can I smash him? Oh dear, I can. Always wanted his ashes scattered here. Um, I really hope this place doesn't have a prison system. I might be going there if it does. Shoo. Da 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 da. I but just as he's getting a handle on it, the security takes it for a petty thief. Oh dear. Ah. 
Ow, ow, ow. Special delivery. Gas colors. Oh dude, crits are leather taping. I get a bit uneasy around leather taping crits. Windbags start turning up for last call. Oh, there's a lot of them. Ow. Oh, too bad. Stay away from me. Please. More squirts start coming out of the woodwork. Oh, more slugs. I really don't like the slugs. A big old fella. Oh god, he's green. I don't like the color green. Die, 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 ow, 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 die. Spraying bullets with a repeater, that's, that's brilliant. <laughs> Kid sees the weight of the bastion out the window. It's a bit of a drop. I don't want to jump out the window. Oh dear. Whee! He gets a good look at things on his way down. He lands on top of a breaker's Ow. bow, and it ain't broke. That looks pretty painful. How could he survive that? How could he survive landing on a bow? Oh yeah, he must be suffering from main character syndrome. Like. Same thing almost every character in every he anime suffers a good from. For some target practice. Oh. oh wow. He knows he should draw the string all the way back. Oh man, I can shoot two walls. Can I interrupt? No, I can't. I thought I could maybe block half his through charging an arrow, but you can't. That's handy to know. Something stringy. The kid pockets a memento from a breaker. Once the fastest man in the land. Oh dear. Any more? Good news is the emergency defenses still work. Bad news is they're aiming for the kid. Right back at ya. I've noticed that um, this character keeps, doesn't actually have a name, he just keeps getting called the kid. Does that mean he's the Karate Kid? That would be pretty cool. The Karate Kid's a boss. That would also explain why I can, you know, fall out of buildings and land on crates. And not die. Coral wood. Picks up a few pointers from a dusty old tome. Ah, uh, die you slug. You lay me things. And then, he falls to his death. Oh man. I'm just fooling. <laughs> that was some pretty cool narration. I actually thought I was dead there for a minute. It's good that the narrator just kind of goes along with what you're doing. He finds the distillery, right next to the arsenal. Tough part of town. Why, thank you, Morgan Freeman. Um, wow, they keep an arsenal right next to the distillery, so you can, you know, buy your weapons, then rob the place. The arsenal's where the kid can pick the best tools for the job. Okay, maybe you can't... Oh yeah, you don't actually buy weapons here, you just kind of change what you... What you've got equipped. One sip of the spirits in that distillery, and the kid will feel like a new man. 10% max health, critical chance. I probably want to make 10 max health. Oh dear, I almost fell off the map again. Oh yeah, He's I haven't tried that yet. Learner. That's pretty good. Some of them squirts birthing like crazy in a couple of corn bins. Oh, uh, oh dear. The corn bins. Is that like one of those popcorn dispensers? Oh dear, is popcorn looking after DJ after these things? That's, that's not too good. Oh, uh, world would not pack. Oh yeah, it's okay, they're, they're dead. They're dead. Destroyable scenery. I should really stop getting distracted by destroying scenery. Sorry. Oh, there's something over here. 
No, no, not the woman. They got the woman too. Oh uh, no. Not how we're gonna repopulate this place. That one was Maud, the tutor. Once taught the kid good manners. He never used them though. Probably because he never talks. It's like I still got a golden sun, he never never talks. An old ferry barge sends the kid on his way. The bastion's real close now. What is this bastion I keep hearing about? Oh my god, that one has a shotgun. Oh my god, you're a boss. Oh dear. I should probably just stand and block, shouldn't I? I wonder if I can deflect shotgun blast. That's some pretty cool sitar jamming in the background there. Indian dubstep. Kid takes a chunk of alloy, smell of barley and spoiled blueberries. Oh god, what's happening? Ah, it's a board of those things! Ah! Uh, I don't like these things. Kid maybe shouldn't have done what he just did. Oh, what does that have? Time to run out of black tonic. Kid puts him out of his way. Oh, I love it up. Level up. <laughs> then you guys played uh oh or beast you probably know what that's from. <laughs> I love that game. The Sega on the whole is pretty damn cool. Um yeah. In fact the first game I ever played was for the Sega. Sonic 2. I was considering doing a let's play of that, but then I kinda of thought Um nah, there's probably too many of those out there. I might still do one. Depends. But yeah, it's Sonic 2. First game I ever played. That was, that was pretty cool. Oh, the colorful blocks. He finds the core to the wharf district. The core. I don't, I don't want to take this. This might cause something pretty bad to happen. Um. He steals the city's heart. Might as ah, well. Ah, yeah, there we go. Yep, everything's getting destroyed. I'm not sticking around to destroy these. I'm just going to run. Oh, boy. Kid has a feeling he better get a move on. The place is starting to fall. See that oh, core kid took was the only thing making this. White balls flying thing. everywhere. What are those things even firing at me? I probably don't want to know. Kid like just keeps running. Yep, yeah, I got him. Oh, there's fun stuff over there. Ah, the food's getting in my way. Ow. Painful. Haha, <laughs> they got hit by a meteor. Sucks to be them. Okay, I, I appear to be clear of the. Uh, I'm destroying this place. So I can kind of relax and destroy them. Oh, that's where I'm meant to be going anyway. Skyway. What's that? Oh, where it needs to go. Can I kind of fly? Now the kid sees something stranger still. Oh. His mind races. He's always falling to places. Probably gonna end up with a concussion sooner or later. Did anybody else survive? I really hope other people survive. I don't want to be the sure only person. Sure enough, he finds another. I die? He oh. finds me. Oh, hi, Margaret Freeman. Are you... are you God? We talk for a spell. There's a bit of the Bastion's power in that crest. Enough to point the way to the cores. Oh, that's... All I tell him is to set that core of his on the monument there. Then watch. Sweet. I try to let the kid down gently. This is the Bastion, all right. Except no one else showed up. Oh man, that's pretty depressing. I should miss this character's feelings by, you know, completing his objective. Yay! And just like that, the bastion comes alive. Starts growing again. 
grown stronger. Kids gotta put its power to good use. Now the Bastion can send them even farther into the wild unknown. Well, it's kind of like a third world Minecraft. You have no materials. Ha ha ha. Coconut course. The kid ponders what to build. Um, I probably wanted the story. Changing my weapons doesn't seem too handy right now. And I level up, so I have another slot. Makes time to sample Yay. spirits from my personal supply. Oh dear. Morgan Freeman's an alcoholic. Oh man. That's pretty good. Yeah, 100% critical chance. Unless. Yeah, so I'll lose it if my health drops below 30%. Yeah, that's fine. That sounds pretty good. Alright. Um, this seems like a pretty good place to end it, so. I hope you, you don't guys know enjoyed watching. Oh, no, no, Morgan, Morgan Freeman's interrupting me. <laughs> That, just because you're a god, Martyr Freeman, doesn't mean you can interrupt me. Yeah, this does seem like a pretty good place to end it. So, yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed watching. Like this, rate it, whatever. Uh, comment. Give us some other ideas, and I'll, uh, I'll see you guys in the next episode. Ciao.